Damn, Daniel. Back it again with those sentient robots. What's up, guys? Welcome back to another fantastic episode of Burnout. We're gonna be jumping right back into Soma. Excuse me, I may be a little tired. I am feeling pretty shitty right now. But if you haven't seen the rest of this, please go watch the first episode. It is crazy good. Basically, we need to go find the comm center right now. We've awoken up with this big-ass bitch of a spaceship or fucking underwater ship. I have no idea what to even call it. But yes, we got this guy's card and everything, I believe. I think we already got into the computer for that, so we don't really need to do that again. We're trying to actually look for somebody to help this robot over here. He thinks he's a human, even though that's his dead body right there, and his mind has basically been implanted into a robot, I believe. I think they're switching subconsciousness into robots and shit, and that is very, very interesting to me. <laughs> but anyways, let's just go up here. I have heard... I have heard that- oh shit, okay, that was a bad idea. I think we just need to go upstairs. We need to find this comm center, so apparently it's in the big old domicile room, which should not be too hard to find. At least I'm hoping not, even though I hear this big ass ostrich looking robot trying to attack us. I have no idea why. I mean, I'm a nice guy, so I don't, I don't see why he's got a problem with me. And by this point, I kind of believe that we might be a robot, but you know, I'm starting to think not, because I've seen what the robots actually look like, and it's not me. What the fuck? Access the comm centers via stairs. Okay, can I not do that? Alright, well then, let's try to go over here. And maybe we actually need to get inside this door code. Alright, 07, okay, we've already put it in. I logged in, power manager. Nice, okay, insufficient power, no solutions. Comm center, can I like change any of this? Please, storage, on, flow control on. Hell yeah, that's, that's what I'm looking for. Alright, I think, I think that's gonna do something for us. Something anyways. Alright, perfect. This door is actually open for us now. Even though it's not what we needed. Mal control. Alright, I don't know what the mal control is going to do for us, but it's gotta do something. We're gonna quick touch this weird looking butthole thing. I don't think we should touch it. I mean it might be left a little bit of a shit finger, but you know that's a that's a part of the game. <laughs> oh shit man, why? Why do people gotta do this to me? Alright, let's quick read this. Read this. We strain the system. If you pull the lever, there's no turning back. Make sure you want it bad enough. I don't know what I want bad enough exactly here. Probably quick check around here and make sure that there's nothing that we need. Press RB to throw an object. Ba Boom. All right, we throw an object. Nothing really happens. <laughs> All right, so let's pull this down. All right, power transfer. And now I believe that'll allow us to actually make it up to the comm center. Maybe, because this lever won't let me fucking pull it. I have no reason why. Oh my god! Go away, go away, go away. Oh, Jesus Christ, he's right fucking there. He needs to go away, go away, go away. Um, I'm thinking maybe we gotta go back up here. I have no idea, but I really need to stay away from this motherfucker. He is not a nice person, all right? Come on, not gonna let me go through here? <laughs> Boy, so screwed. Oh, I didn't even notice that there's this little door right here. Um, does it have anything to do with anything, though? It appears not, it appears not. Alright, we need to hide. Go away, go away, go away, guy. Fucking running right past you. Fuck you, dude. Alright, um, hopefully we didn't just shut off that robot. That'd be very bad. Because he needs to stay alive for us. Oh, shit. You know what? I think I may have actually turned him off, which is not cool. It's not cool with me. So we're just gonna turn this power off anyways, because I believe that will actually shut down some power that we actually need. Let's go back to this computer. Hopefully, it'll allow us to do some more shit. No, I can't fucking get past this goddamn robot. Go away. Go away, you little bitch. Why? What is up with this? Access to comms. I have no idea why it won't let me do anything. But it's very, very annoying. Oh, shit. Shit, 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 shit. Come on, go around. Go around, you little bastard. Let's throw this jerry can. Let's distract this big-ass robot. Please go away, sir. Please. Just leave. Fuck. And he sees me every time. I don't know where to go. Alright, we're going to this robot. Fuck it. We're gonna do it. We're gonna do this. I'm, oh shit. Oh shit. There's another door open. Nice. Alright, can I close this though? I mean, I'd rather that thing not be open, seeing these people are trying to fucking kill me this whole time. The CRV black box. Alright, do we need a black box? Uh, precision instrument designed to observation overall condition. It measures a wide range of data from body temperature to brain wave activity. Alright, that's all we got time for right there. Um, oh shit, we can actually take this thing. What are we using it for though? God damn it. Um, I don't know if I need it. It's not letting me do anything with it. Like, this makes no sense. I fucking A. I'm so lost. There we go! Cop center is on, finally. 
All right, we're gonna make it past this guy. Wherever the hell he even is. All right, go, 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 go. Flip the switch. Flip the fucking switch. Damn it. And we're dead. We got a second chance, all right? That robot should be gone now, right? Right? Yes, we got ourselves a nice open door. We better be able to close this thing. All right, boom. How do you like that, you little son of a bitch? All right, we need to quick heal ourselves with the butthole machine. Um, I don't know if anybody has ever dared stick anything else besides the finger in it, but I have a feeling that it would not be a good idea. <laughs> but anyways, let's quick go to this. Uh, before I check that, I want to look out around the room, actually maybe read some notes, read some things, read some stuff. Update. Update on the defense measurements. Find efforts to globally community to prevent collision has failed. Pathos 2 should make any final efforts to deal with the investable... Oh, an inevitable quake following impact. Estimated time of impact. Impact of what? The office is closing and everyone is being uh, evacuated. From everyone here, I want to say it's been an honor working with you, Upsilon. Godspeed and good luck with the apocalypse. What, we, what a fucking apocalypse. Like, seriously. Um, it is with great sadness I have to inform you that the office will close no longer support Upsilon and Pathos 2. I will... Take this opportunity to thank you, your supervisor, Jane Adams, the rest of the staff. You are a terrific group, and it is with great confidence I say that we were that there where we fall, you will certainly carry out with bravery. Okay, let's finally. What's this one? Um, Jonesy, I know you have a much better chance of survival, but we have a better view. Salute. Oh shit, they kind of left Sony behind, did they? It's kind of fucked up, ain't it? All right, let's turn this on. Um. We need a goddamn password. All right, I'm pretty sure it's in this thing. Corrupted data detection, restore files. Sure, why not? Audio player. Oh shit, there's a lot of them. What are they all gonna do? Partial data recovery, successful. Josie, has coming along? We've got everything we need to move, but we can't leave the plant without supervision. Adams decided to leave Amy, Asaro, and Kalsanka to execute the automatization process. And I bet they're thrilled about it. Carl Semkin is dead now, guy. All right, you do that, buddy. Oh, totally. I wanted to introduce you to Amy and Carl. They'll be doing the talking as soon as I leave for Theta. Say hello. Hey, Theta. Hello. Hey, guys. I'm Peter Strass, doing dispatcher at Theta. Just let me know if there's anything I can do to help. Huh. That seems so nice before all this. All right, check out this hey, last one. Somebody hello? give me the code, hey, damn it! I need the code. Absalon, what's up? We could really use direct contact with Heather. Uh, I mean, uh, site service engineer Wolchek. Direct links are almost impossible to establish. The Lumar relays are basically junk at this. Point. You can send messages via the comm center, if you want, the machine is here, ready to relay anything by hand. I, I know it's a shitty system, but it's all that works right now. All right, what does that have to make do? Catch you later. Catch you later. Alright, somebody give me the fucking code already. Hello? Peter, was it? Yeah, I'm here. What's up? We're getting out. I just want to tell you that I'm going to seal the comm center now, so this is definitely the last you'll hear from us. If we don't show up in the next couple of hours, send in the cavalry. Hang on, what's happening? It's still the same plan, right? Yeah. We'll head for the shuttle and ride it directly to Theta. Okay, good. I'll rally the troops for a welcome party. <laughs> That's what I like to hear. Hmm. Okay, still no code, you sons of bitches. I need the code. I need the code. Ah. 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 Okay, it's gotta be somewhere around this room. So I'm gonna take a quick look, guys. Once I find it, I'll come back to you. I'll, I'll come back to you. Oh, wait, shit. We should probably just use Carl Semkin's thing. Upsilon. Oh, all the codes are right there. Nice. Delta, Omicron, Pau, Phi, Omega. Um, We should probably try Theta, right? All right, let's try 22 O. Two. Okay. Nothing. Oh, we actually gotta find all this. Shit, man. Let's go. Oh shit, we were so close right there. Boom! There we go. Connected. All right, you got anything for us? Site theta establishing. I'm hoping that's it, anyways. Here. What's here? Site theta is offline. Fuck, who do we need to talk to? I don't remember. All right, let's try this one more time. All right, let's go back. Limbin, uh, Delta, Omicron, Tau, Phi, Omega. Like, I don't know whether to the try all these. Um, because we're in Upsilon right now, I think. I'm not entirely sure. 
All right, go to that. Unable to call from site Epsilon. All right, then let's try 22, uh, three. Okay, and now we're gonna find this bitch. Ba bam! Perfect. All right, site Lambda. Hey, are you there? There we go. Finally. I found the dome ceiling. Oh, that's better. Oh shit. Simon, oh, it's the chick uh, from the Jared, picture. Simon no way. Jared. Hi, oh, Simon. My God. I'm Catherine. Have you figured out what's going on yet? Me? Fuck no. I was hoping you'd have some answers. I probably have some. What do you want to know? Everything. Where do you even like... begin? I mean, what is this place? How did I get here? And, and why do the robots talk like they're people? Well, you're at Upsilon, clearly. Have you never been there before? Where did you work? The Grimoire in Toronto. Is that really important? No, I mean, where did you work at Pathos 2? I don't know what that is. That's unexpected. Did you come directly from Toronto? Yeah, we don't I know. Did. We sat in a and fucking chair unexpected. and it woke up and in. <laughs> people? Like staff or field technicians? No. Only robots. Crazy ones. Except for one. I think he said his name was Carl. He was okay, but I'm... I'm pretty sure I accidentally killed him by turning off the power. Oh. I'm so sorry. Well, you know, robots don't feel anything. Oh, they so. clearly fucking do. You should have heard yeah. this dude. Like last episode when we turned off the power, what he started that? screaming and screaming for help. It made me feel so bad. Like, I think oh, this shit. place is about to collapse. What do oh, I do? Oh, no, 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 no. Simon, come to Lambda. Uh, how, how do I get there? Oh god damn it. Fine. Fine. Go, go, go. Oh my god. I have no idea where the fuck I need to go. The handle's gone, man. Oh. Oh my god. I have no idea what's going on, but this is intense. Like, holy shit. Oh, did that handle just break off? Did I just break that thing? Oh. Give me some jitters, guys. Woo! <laughs> this game is getting so good, though. I mean, I'm just loving the atmosphere. It's really suspenseful with everything that's happening. Oh, fuck. We're trapped underwater. How are we going to live from this? How are we living right now? What? We should be drowning, right? What the hell? How is this possible? Whoa! Whoa! This is insane! We're a fucking robot, aren't we? I, I know it! I know we're a damn robot! You just need to tell me the truth here. Like, seriously, we are a robot, are we not? All right, let's just jump up. Unless, I don't know. I don't know how else that suit would just randomly get on us. I'm pretty sure we're a robot, though. I mean, look at our arms. It all seems very, I don't know. Like, maybe it changes to show people that we're human, and maybe it's just a trick. Unless they just fucking teleport a suit on you or something I've god I have no fucking clue I'm so confused at this take a quick screenshot <laughs> a screenshot will make everything better and I don't know whether I should go up here or not I kind of want to I kind of want to see what's going on over here oh shit we can open this but will it fucking open and it does not all right we can do this we'll find ourselves a way it's got to be something somewhere right all right, where is this taking us? What does this say? Um, the pill transport. All right, yes, we need the pill transport. But it looks like there's nobody here. And they do not wish me all the luck in the world. Not at this point. Ah, oh, God damn it! Look at all this. What is that big? I'm just waiting for some giant, like, robot creature to come and fucking take me down or something. I'm kind of afraid about it. I don't want that to happen. Oh shit, is this door actually gonna open? Uh, no, it does not. I like all the sci-fi music going on, though. Like, I feel like this will make for a great fucking movie. A lot of video games make for great movies. Like, GTA V, that could have been a fantastic movie. At least if they just stick to the story mode of that game. It's just so interesting and fun. But we're not talking about that. <laughs> Alright, let's just keep going. We got ourselves a little uh, underwater mushrooms and things and stuff. I'm waiting to also see a big daddy just walking around down here, even though I don't want to. I'm pretty sure he'd fuck my ass up, seeing we don't have any kind of weapons or anything. Uh, yes, turn on little light. I like that. I like that. It's very... It very makes me feel very safe. How long can we come down here? Data buffer. All right, let's see what kind Hello, of information this thing's got us. You better answer me, Strasky. Come on! Amy, where, where are you? The field. I had to leave. Is Carl with you? It all went to hell. Carl's dead! Carl is dead! Get that through your head! 
<laughs> Alright, so I, I still really don't know why this place went to shit. I mean, I understand that robots started going sentient and stuff and started uh, getting minds of their own, it seems like, unless people just started getting their consciousness transferred to them, they don't realize it, but... Oh... What? We mean he got someone to spare. Can I? Oh no 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 no! I'm sorry. I don't want to talk to you. What the fuck, dude? That thing. Give me some of your pain. Like, what are these things? They're so creepy. So creepy, and I can't stand it. Like, fuck. Don't make me the bad guy. I'm not! You're the bad guy! You're trying to fucking kill me! Leave me alone! I don't know what you want from me. You're just a weird ass little robot. Oh, I think he needs some of that stretch gel, whatever it was. They were talking about a lot in the first episode of us playing this. Like, I think it's just what runs the robots, kind of like their oil supply, almost something like that. But I have a feeling it's a little more than that. Maybe that's what's uh, collecting consciousness and whatnot, fucking creating their own cells and domiciles for thinking. <laughs> I'll help you. I'll help you, little robot. What are you, though? Can you help me? Or are you just gonna kill me? Like, you better not just kill me. Maybe you can show me the way or something? I don't know. Can I jump into you? It's like all breathing hard, like he's wheezing or something, but he's a goddamn robot, so it don't make any sense. Um, alright, I'm seeing a ways to go over there, but I'm also seeing some green lights over here that I want to check out real quick right here. Um, is there any other fucking little robots that want to come out here and just fuck me up? Hopefully not. Hopefully not. I don't even think we can get up here. Unless I can jump up. Come on, go! So close. So close. Oh shit, what do you want, little robot? What do you want from me? I, would, I really wish you'd just leave me alone, first of all. Alright, come on, jump up there. <gasps> are we making it? We are making it! Nice! Alright, um, Upsilon B. But it doesn't, there's no entrance to get in this thing, so I'm pretty sure that was the wrong fucking way. Oh, dear lord, I guess I could have just kept on walking straight and I probably would have found my way! Oh, that makes me so mad! Dear, what the hell is all this stuff? Look at that structure, it looks so evil. Why do they build things like that? And I keep meeting those weird red floating submarine looking robots to keep asking me for structure gel that we could share and I just I just really don't trust him at all <laughs> alright little robot can you open this for me oh he can okay now I get it shuttle station Upsilon B thank you little buddy I was wondering why you were following me he just wants a friend that's all alright alright uh, do we have to do anything with this I feel like probably not right no no is thing gonna open now Thanks, little guy. Yeah, you're so nice. No, don't go away. You're my only friend. <laughs> All right, let's just keep going. Looks like this can be opened now. I probably should have tried some of those other doors. I probably should have took them back around. He probably would have opened them for me. Anyways, let's finally get inside. Let's shit this bitch. I'm so sick of those red rob or robots. They scare the shit out of me. I mean, they're so evil looking and sounding at the same time. Um, all right, how do we do this here? All right, swipe my control thing. Oh yeah, X is granted. Everything's looking bright and beautiful, and I'm loving it. All right, come on. Let's get all this water out of here. It's way too fucking much. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, there we go. So now what, do I have regular arms now? Or do I still have this suit on? I'm not entirely sure. Whoa. Whoa, game. Okay, it was freezing there for a second there. I don't like that. Let's uh, the shuttle still work. It scares me. Yeah, let's hope. It is awfully fucking dark in here though, and that's not looking good for us. How did I? What? Where did I get a flashlight? Seriously, dude, we're a robot. All right, you just need to accept it by now. <laughs> I take the data buffer. Come in, Theta. Theta's gone. What? I can't. It's just there. Darky, I'm at the shuttle. What's this all about? The lights are like mad. I, I think the power regulator is broken. Alrighty. Can I open any of these? Hell no, I can't. How about you? There we go. Hopefully it'll actually take us somewhere though. I don't I don't really trust using something that looks like this. It kinda looks like a piece of shit. <laughs> 
All right, let's see what this says. Manifest. Um, manifest, shot of hole, items, ticket, Lawrence, helper ticket, impact event. Oh, damn it, damn it. No, 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 no. Take it back. Take it back. We need to see stuff on that. We need to check out that manifest ticket or impact thing. On this morning, January 12th, fire 513, the comet Talos crashed in the Pacific Ocean and the impact ranked as one of the largest collisions ever recorded on Earth. All evidence indicates that the surface has gone completely barren and is no longer able to sustain life. Pathos 2 unique location has provided unparalleled safety to our staff. Um, some structural damage has been noted, but no casualties reported. The lo largest loss was the weather and communicational station located on the surface platform Omega. Unconfirmed, which is under the circumstances a small price to pay. What will hold an emergency meeting to discuss the future of Pathos 2 and ultimately mankind? More on the matter will follow. Overseer. Oh shit, so it like took down the entire planet. Alright, so it like destabilized everything. All the land and everything is just starting to kind of fall in and move around to itself. But let's quick watch this. Whatever it's gonna be. <laughs> it's a good thing we never had any kids. Hard enough looking my parents in the eyes. Why? They're going to a bomb shelter upstate, by the way. Along with your dad. I'm guessing someone will help him send you a message somehow. I mean, I hope they will. Pal. Me too, I'm man. Sure Me too. This message. <sighs> if you do. I want you to know, I never blamed you for following your dreams. It just... <laughs> I was just mad it didn't fit better with what I imagined our lives would be. I really wanted the picket fence, big family, you know? <laughs> I guess what I'm trying Little to say is, I'm proud of you. And even though it's been difficult to be separated from you, I regret nothing. I'm happy. And... I really wish I was able to say this without the sky falling down. <laughs> Sorry, guy. Oh, you, Amy. I always have. And always will. Wow, that was actually pretty fucking sad, that was. Alrighty then, um, might as well quick see this, got a bunch of bolts and stuff, I don't know if that's all the stuff that we're gonna need, hopefully not, I really don't want to go gather a bunch of things, alright, I just want to progress with the story. Let's quick touch this butthole though, that'll, that'll cheer our spirits, I think. <laughs> oh, shit! Jesus Why Christ. is he doing that? What the hell? Yeah, what the fuck, man? That is not cool. Not cool at all. Insufficient storage power. All right, boom. Oh, fuck me. All right, well, what's that gonna do for us? Is it gonna open any doors or anything? No, of course it doesn't. All right, I'm guessing that we just gotta go through here through this little transport, wherever it's gonna take us. Even though I hear that terrible noise, it does not sound good. But fuck it, fuck it, we're gonna move on. We're gonna move on through these rocks, even though it looks scary as all hell. What do you guys think of this game so far? Do you want to see me playing more of this, or do you want me to save this one for myself and move on to something different? I mean, I hope you want me to play with you guys, because this is pretty damn cool, and I really enjoy myself recording this one. This one that I can actually uh, feel good about having to record every single day. You know, it's, um, it's actually pretty fun. It just keeps me going. Oh, fuck, dude. Why? Why? And I know it's weird that I'm taking pictures of that, but hey, they make good ass thumbnails, you know, it just works out great. Alright, let's throw some shit. Let's throw some shit. Get out of here, you fucking person. I don't trust you at all. Hey, Can we talk to you? Are you? Don't hurt me. I won't. Can I help? It won't let me die. Nothing is allowed to die. God, that's so fucked up. Like, what is this? What happened? An accident. Fixing the power. I was going to Theta. Anything I can do? If you see Masters or Harwin, tell them I need help. Okay? Amy needs help. Oh, they're all asking for help, and it's so messed up. Like, what is that thing pumping into her? Is it involuntary, or does she want that? I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but I gotta pull your cords. No. Uh, Are you okay? I don't know. I want to go home. Oh man, quit making me do this shit! This is so effed! Go home. Oh, fuck. Fucking be at peace. I, I'm closing your eyelids, I am. Oh. 
Don't make me do this stuff. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. I didn't want to do that, but it made me, all right? There's no people to help you around here, and you should not be sitting here deep and alone under fucking water just standing there getting shit pumped in you by a machine. Like, ah, I can just imagine it. It sounds like hell. It sounds like a real version of hell. <laughs> Upsilon shuttle station B, power supply stable, basic systems powered. All powered. Oh, shit. They're always taking up all the power to the things that we need to be. And it's rude, all right? It's just plain rude. But god damn, that makes you feel so messed up killing them like that. But you have no choice. The game gives you no fucking choice, and I hate it. All right, quick duck down. Let's get on through here. Oh, fuck. Fuck, man. No, what are you doing? You're like, uh, 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 inside the rocks. I don't appreciate that, not one bit. All right, let's get right over to the station. Should be nice. Should be great. Hopefully we can actually open. Oh wait, no, we can just open up this thing now, right? Power's off. Power on! <laughs> All right, beautiful. All right, where's this fish gonna take us? Upsilon, Theta, location. Do we need to pick where we're gonna be going? I have a feeling we probably do, right? Oh shit. Hell yeah, onto the trams, onto the trams. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Alright, take this. I guess we gotta throw that bitch in there. No, wait, do I need to pick where I need to be going or no? Alright, fine, we're just gonna take a seat, see where this thing's gonna take us. I'm hoping to see some weird ass sea creatures or something, anything. Maybe just some kind of weird ass robot. Alright, one. Initiation. On. Beautiful. Alright, now what? Now what? What do you what do you need me to do here? I need to lean in or something. No, 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 no. Get back in your seat. Get back in your little swivel chair. All right, that's where we need to be. Oh, we got this red button. Boom. Ba bow. All right, Upsilon B, you are here. We need to go to Lambda, right? Not Theta, not Delta. Where are we? Yes, let's go to Lambda. Confirm destination of Lambda. Yes, boom. All right, sweet. Departing. To Lambda, hopefully we'll actually get to meet this Amy chick. I think that was her name anyways. Hopefully she's not a robot herself and just doesn't realize it. I'm pretty sure we're gonna realize it. I'm pretty damn sure that we are a robot, unless we're just wearing that suit. I have no idea. Thank you. The world's most affordable way to launch satellites and deep space probes. Oh, no way. That's actually really cool. Location ...allows for this gigantic coil gun running longer than a marathon to safely launch projectiles without risk of damaging the payload with risky combustion. No way. So what, it's basically a giant spring? Together they are able to produce, assemble, and launch the world's most sophisticated spacecrafts. In addition to our principal operation, Pathos 2 is also the home for multiple research projects within the marine sciences, including hydroculture, turbulence, and deep sea construction. We are now leaving Upsilon for Lambda. Lambda is Pathos 2's shipping dock and transportation hub. There, you will be able to find shuttle trains leading to all the other parts of the station. Oh, fuck. Why do you gotta make that kind of noise? Like, I hate that. Fuck. It's not so bad. That's so evil. But it feels so low down in this tunnel. Like, we're so far underwater, I hate it. I really do. Like, it's just terrible. Oh, fuck. No, 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 no. What the hell's going on here? Shit. Of course something like this is gonna happen. God damn it. God damn it, guys. <laughs> this is not good for us. This is very bad. It's not good for our health. Oh, that powering down noise. I hate it. I really do. I really, really do. All right, we need to take this. This is mine. I'm taking it with me. I don't care if you don't want me to. This is the shuttle door gonna open at least for us. This is gonna be some crazy ass fucking monster that's gonna get us. Oh, it's an emergency hatch. Nice. All right. Well then, let's just get on through this. It's safe, right? It's totally safe. There's nothing down here that could potentially kill us. I had a feeling we were gonna have to walk all the way through this, and I really did not want to. Oh shit. Simon. Simon, are you there? Catherine, is that you? I was on my way, but then the shuttle train, it, it fucking crashed. Are you alright? The system says the section is sealed for a suspected hull breach. No, I'm not alright. What the hell happened to the world? 
Why are we underwater? Bro, you really are sick, aren't you? Fuck yeah, I don't, don't understand right what's now. going on. I realize you're confused, but you're so close to Lambda. If you just keep going. Uh, How close? Can I walk there? Yeah, but the tunnel is locked off to protect the overall structure from collapsing. What you need to find is your section's maintenance hatch. It'll lead outside. Maintenance hatch. No problem. What's that? What's going on up there? Whole I bunch is a crazy inside. shit. Oh shit, who is she just talking to? Catherine? You okay? No, now she's gonna die or something. Are you kidding me? But guys, before we get any further, I do have to end this episode right here. I'm sorry, I know it's not a good spot, but I, I have to. Otherwise, it's gonna take literally a day or two just to upload, and I don't want to be. So, I will end this here, quick edit it, do all that, throw it up on YouTube for you guys, and then I'll get on to the next one, and we'll actually go to Lambda. And it should be pretty goddamn interesting, and I will not touch you, thing. You almost swallowed my arm. You're a loose butthole. You're a loose butthole. <laughs> but anyways, guys, I hope you had a great time. I hope you're enjoying this game as much as I am. I really like this one, all right? This is probably one of my favorites so far. If you got any other ones that you want me to play, just let me know, even though I usually pick up all the newest games and stuff. I know this isn't the newest, but I had to play it, all right? I've been eyeballing it for so long. But like I was from Michigan, like I probably already said, have yourself a fantastic day. If you did not subscribe yet, please do, or please do. We have so many videos coming up, guys, and I am just not going to stop, whether you fucking like me or not. <laughs> but I'll see you guys in the next episode. Woo. This is definitely pretty damn hard, but we are going to make it. Just got to find a target. Who will we target? No targets yet. Boom. There we go.